Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Clear by Serious Business. This is a map to experiment with creating a custom style. You guys may remember my last one, Prioritize. I wanted to try and work on the feedback that I got from that. Also, this one is more puzzle-oriented. Should be about medium difficulty. No ninja moves required, just logic. I tried pretty hard to make the skybox world transition look natural, but I just couldn't get it. I wouldn't worked on other things for a while, but today I stumbled across the .bsp and decided that I may as well upload it. And Steam removed the intended solution file link for whatever reason. <laughs> Not sure why. I remember I linked to my boot to my map Bootstrapper, and if the link title was Bootstrapper, Steam would remove it. So I think, uh, like, because the Steam client Bootstrapper is a thing that people might like try to distribute as malware. Like, a modified version of it. I think Steam's trying to, like, remove stuff like that, but I don't know what the demo file could be called that Steam removed. Interesting. This is some very nice-looking aesthetics, even if it is un unfinished. Yeah, that's... that's, uh... It doesn't quite look right out there, but in here it looks great. Alright, so this is the cube that dropped there. The cube went quite a far distance. Man, that goes quite a distance, doesn't it? It's not quite over a portal surface, either. Although, I bet you anything, if I put a portal here, it would totally funnel it. Yep, it funnels it, so that doesn't really matter too much. Alright. Hmm, no ninja moves, okay. I will keep that in mind. Let's, what can we do with the laser? I don't see anything around here we want to point at, so I'll just leave this here for now. Well, first things first, we want to do that, right? Ah, oh, that turns this off. And then turns that on for some reason. Strange. Oh, I see, because the exit is over there. Aha! That makes more sense. Makes much more sense, actually. Hmm. Well, I think we want to do that. That would be my guess. How do we do that without ninja moves? That's a good question, isn't it? Well... For now, I suppose let's just do this. Let's do this! Whee! There we go. My question is, how do we get the cube now? Because, uh, I don't really see a good way to do that. Oh, I should've put- I guess I just should've put the cube in there in advance. Alright, let's do that. Yeah, get in there in advance. There we go. I always look the wrong direction. <laughs> Alright, so now the cube's in there in advance. Now we can just go in here and get it, I believe. Yes! I believe is correct. So let's go ahead and jump across there and carefully aim this. So that's done that for us. Now the question is, what do we need to do here that isn't a ninja move? Do we just need to juggle ourselves? Maybe. I can't remember how high the fizzler goes, but I think it goes this high, based on the colors. Yeah, maybe we could jiggle ourselves. Maybe that might actually work. Is it really that simple, though? Well, let's find out. Yeah, I guess it is that simple. Alright then, on to the next. What's the next puzzle? Oh, that's it. Alright, well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!